everyone welcome back to our channel go dynamic it recently my office 2024 preview version was deleted because i had to format my system and as you know microsoft has stopped offering the preview version and i have been getting questions on whatsapp about how to access office 2024 honestly there is no other way around it we need to buy a official microsoft license to keep things legit i managed to get a great deal on office 365 license and today i will show you how to download and install office 365 on your windows machine so one awesome thing about office 365 is that it lets you use up to five devices at once making it super convenient for personal and official work so let's dive in and install office 365 together okay so you can see this is the window which you see here this is my second machine so main machine i've already downloaded it and here in this machine let me show it to you um let me go to this uh, program of uh, uninstall and install program and you can see here i have a older version this is my older laptop so you can see here i have a office 2016 install on this one and now i'm going to show you how to install office 365 on top of that so guys this office 16 and 365 can be on system together there would be a no problem with that okay so let's go to our browser and here we have to download uh, let's click on like the office 365 login the moment you type the office 365 login in the google it will show you the first link it says that microsoft 365, microsoft 365 login just log in here so basically this this is the online installer office 365 is an online installer we have to go and log into the microsoft site and download the installer so you can see this office 365 65 login information click on here so guys there is no iso or no offline installer for this one you have to go online and download it so downloading this you have to log into your account so while you're creating this once if you buy this license so so vendor will ask you for your email id email id and based on your email email id or you maybe it may be your personal or official email email id they will create an account on office 365 and assign a license to you right so um, as you can see here i'm on a login page click on the sign in here instead of the sign in it says that asking about the email address so let's give my email address here email address the one which i given for the account creation okay so i have given the email id and password and once i enter my username and password i have logged into this account right so let me show you that what are the application i have got along with my account so you can see in the left hand panel you have a home create my content and app right so yes you have to just click on the app to see what are the what are the default app come with your account so you can see here in the productivity so these are the called categories wise so in the productivity you have one note forms calendar uh, engage visio to do projects right uh, there is a lot in this one you can say sharepoint learning power pages right there's a lot of lots of things here see here um, you can so you can go with the utilities educations communication right uh, content management or you can go go with the all apps here so when you click on the all apps you can see the list is here so i think uh, i believe i have got almost all the app you can see you have an outlook as well as well here so the moment i install this office 365 i'll have all this on my system right so let's go ahead and quickly download it on our system so how do we do that we have to go to the home page and in the home page you can see the right side top corner install and uh, more can you see here just click on this and you have an option to click on install microsoft 365 apps just click on it so it will download this uh, tiny installer on my system and okay say so say that uh, office app and devices and you can see here um, maybe it, i'm not sure if it is whether it will be visible for you or not you can say that install office click on this for install office i'll just click on this so it will download that software let me see uh no okay yeah so here we go you can see this office setup.ex so let's click on that and it says that office 360 do you want to install it yes i want to install it and it is a we problem find okay oh sorry for that it says that we have found a problem here it says that microsoft office professional 2016 has found so i'm sorry for that in the beginning of this uh, video i said that uh, you have to we can install this office 2016 and then uh, office 365 together together so that is not possible so let's go ahead and uninstall that software first let me do that quickly for you if you want you can skip the video and you can move it until we uninstall it okay so that was quick so you can say that you can you can see that you say that uninstall successfully close this one gone from here now let's go back to our installer and click on it click on the allow yes and he's saying you can see 
this here we are getting things ready so let's see if it goes smoothly or not and before we go we can see here as i said that uh, in my license it say that you can install office on up to five devices or mac five tablets and five smartphone means one license key you can install on the five devices so if you if you can divide uh, whatever amount you have if you have bought this licenses divided by five so if you bought this licenses on x amount does divide by five you get the actual price of it so i think this is the very convenient right uh, you can go with the lower version of office 365 also uh, there are a lot uh, cheaper i mean there are the other version also, also also available where you don't need these much of application the price will be you know a little bit less so let's see what going on okay so guys you can see here uh, it's trying to install it in the meanwhile um, let's see there is a there was another option you can see um, you can see here you can install this on your mobile phone also so what you have to do is you can see this install microsoft so you have to go to the home page of office 365 and install and more and it says that uh, install the office 365 mobile app click on that so basically you need a excel excel word and outlook three things on your mobile phone right few people have a official account so which you want to access through your mobile phone so you can install outlook and uh, you can um, go with the official you can add your account in into that so once you scan your this qr code it will take you to a play store and from there it will uh, it will uh, download it will allow you to download it right this is how you can do that and what else you can show it to you uh, these are permissions where if you want to uh, change your password and other stuff you can see you have to go to the my account portal and uh, change the password you can go to the my account portal and change the password app and devices yeah so while it's downloading uh, we'll wait for it and once completed we'll come back again okay and finally you can see on my screen it says that installation finished and here it said all set right close and uh, let's see if we have a office look like office 365 has been installed because i can see this excel icon here but however we can go to uh, add remove program and when we can verify it and uh, you can you can see here office 365 app for enterprise this has been installed on my system so that's good so let's open this uh, word here and here we go we have a microsoft word here perfect perfect yeah that's good let's see if we have other application so let's check this excel okay so i do have a excel also installed on this system uh, it says that okay so let's say use this dark i love this dark theme and you can see here this dark theme is also ready right so guys i think we have covered this agenda for today's video if you have any questions query or any feedback related to this video please do let me know in the comment box and thank you very much for watching the video see you in the next one